Welcome then to our fourth and final video on Pi Game Zero, creating your simple first game. Um, in this video then we're going to have a look at adding a background to the game and then also um, adding in or creating additional characters. So let's run our game. Um, we have our simple character moving across the screen. If you click them, they say, you got me. If you click off them, they change back and say, you missed me. What we're going to do now is add a background in. Um, now the background needs to be a PNG file and I've added one to the GitHub page um, for you to, to use. You can find your own image if you want to. As I said, make sure it is a PNG file and you're probably trying to go for a file that is approximately the size of the, um, the, the background. So about a thousand about a thousand by a thousand. Right, the image I've got is called space, so we're going to click on that, open up the image, right click, save image as, and again we're going to put it into our image folder. So we're going to go uh, home, images, space PNG. Okay, so that's available there now. Right, um, so draw function. We are going to add in the background. So this is our draw function here, which draws the screen, clears it, and uh, this is stops our character from moving across the screen. Uh, I think I spoke about this in video number two. If I actually... Um, comment that out we run it you'll see that it builds up <laughs> loads of the character which is quite a nice effect but eventually the program's going to fail so this is why we were cleaning the clear clear sorry this is why we're clearing the this is why we're clearing the screen uh, what we want to do then is add the background so we're going to use something called a blit and um, in order to do this we use screen So screen, oops, sorry, screen dot blit. Okay, open bracket, quotation mark. And then the name of the background, which was space. Okay, close. And then finally, we have to tell the program where to place it. So we want it to be placed in the top left hand corner, which is up here. So zero, zero, place it up there. Let's run the program. Uh, what's going on here? Oh, I haven't closed the last tag. There we go. So here's our space. But our character has disappeared. Mm, okay. Let's see what's happened. Right, so you'll notice here then that the game character is drawn and then this is drawn on top of it. Now, I don't want that to happen. I need to draw the background and then draw the, the game hero, Luigi, on top. So switch them round, press run. Oh, still got that one open, apologies. That. Here we go, then run that, and here he is now in space. Click, you're on our Raspberry Pi, missed you. Brilliant. Now, you might want to add another character, so we can use what we've got here, um, except for obviously we want to make sure that we have a different name. So let's copy that, paste it down here, and uh, let's call this Game Hero 2. Okay, the actor this time is going to be alien. Now we don't want to start them in the same. Well, actually, we could start them in the same position. We'll just move them, uh, move them around. We can keep the height the same because it's basically picking the height from the actor here, which is uh, which is absolutely fine. 
we need to draw game hero 2 so we're going to copy that paste that in and we can run that so this should give our alien there's our lovely alien obviously not moving at the moment because we haven't added any features to the alien to move right now here's our instructions so as the game updates obviously the character moves so we can go copy and we can paste this in and we can have game hero 2 and let's go right so we're going to get them to go the opposite direction and if game hero 2 right is greater than the width then game hero we just swap this one left because they're going to come back in over this side so now we should have two characters I think I've uh, done something wrong there oh I've still got them to the right there let's stop that a minute right game hero ah so I need to do minus in here because I want it to move the opposite direction there we go bye Thank you then for watching uh, the video series on Pi Game. Um, you can now begin to create your own version of this game, uh, create your own sounds, backgrounds, messages, and um, uh, you know, customize it as you want. Um, obviously, if you do create something, um, send me a link um, or, uh, or let me know. And don't forget to check out the next set of videos, which is building a more complicated game involving aliens, a rocket and a missile.